What's up y'all? It's your girl Mori and I am back with another video. Guys, I'm so excited for today's look. Oh, my skin is looking lovely. Anyway, so I'm going to do this another creative look. And once again, guys, I'm winging it. I really just have this idea in my head. So I'm about to just take y'all into the steps not into the steps through the steps with me um i'm doing like something with purple i got some paint some body paint and i think i'm gonna section my face into fours and just go crazy so i'm not gonna do too much talking and yeah i'm trying to think if i had anything else to say no i don't have nothing else to say so let's go ahead and get into this look Okay, y'all, so I already did one eyebrow filling in. The other eyebrow is going to be a different color. So what my idea is, I'm going to section my face into four. Somehow, someway, I'm sectioning it into four. So two parts are going to be regular, two parts are going to be whatever you guys are going to see. So I already filled in this eyebrow. Now this eyebrow, I'm just gonna take some glue. This is a regular Elmer's glue stick. And I'm just laying down the hairs on my eyebrow. And then I'm gonna take some powder and Take some powder and just put it on this eyebrow because we're turning this bad boy a different color. So I'm just gonna place it on top of the eyebrow to basically create in like a blank canvas for my eyebrow. Put that up on it, then I'm gonna take a brush and just brush it off, the excess powder off. All right, so here's our brows. Now we're gonna start with the paint. So I'm just gonna um, the paint came with one of these uh, paint brushes to use, which is very easy. I'm happy to engage with these. I'm going to go in with this purple right here, and I'm going to paint this one and this one. I'm gonna keep going I'm gonna go in keep painting and when I finish painting each section I'll come back and show you guys the next step but so far we get real creative over here okay guys <laughs> So now that we have the paint on, I'm just gonna wet a beauty blender a little bit and um, just kind of clean it up and blend it out. I think I'm gonna have to add one more layer of the purple, but we are gonna see after we blend it. And I'm just gonna take, <coughs> oh, excuse me. I'm just gonna take some time and we're gonna blend this. I'm really, I'm really winging this, guys. I'm just going with the crazy creative thoughts in my head. And so far, it's coming out how I planned. So we just gonna keep going with it. 
and keep on blending. I'm definitely gonna have to go over this eyebrow again, but we're gonna get into that when I'm done. Okay guys, so I have been blended the paint and I think I'm gonna spray a little satin spray because this, um, it's oil paint, so I just kind of wanted to dry up a little bit. I don't want to put any white powder because I don't know. But I just spray a little set and spray, let that dry, and then this is looking so cool. So cool. So now I'm going to go back in with. This palette go in with this dark purple again. This is the matte book from the crayon case, and I'm just gonna take this dark color and go along the white lines just to kind of give it like a little I guess you could say like a 3D effect. Oh my god, this is looking so crazy. <laughs> Um, once I find this brush, this brush okay, so I'm just gonna take this purple and just go in. along the line here. Just like that. All right, guys. So we have it outlined now. I think I'm just gonna go in with this beauty blender and kind of just blend it out like that. To give it the full effect. All right, oh guys, this is the effect is really coming in. I'm gonna do the top part. I, one thing I could say, this is a, you gotta be very careful with this because the paint is kind of oily. I did spray some satin spray, but it's giving. So I'm gonna finish blending and we'll be back for the next step. I'm excited. <laughs> Okay guys, so now that everything is blending, it's a little dirty down here, but I'm gonna clean that up. I think I need to add, I gotta, I'm gonna like, 
so particular. Let me just finish this line right here. When I tell y'all this is very like tedious, it's very tedious, but I'm having so much fun doing it. I'm having so much fun. I'm having so much fun doing it. So now, I'm going to do the eyeshadow on the purple. Again, I'm going in with this matte book. And I'm gonna go start with that dark purple as the transition. As the transition color. And just gonna take it up here. And blend it out. Which this paint makes it really easy to put this eyeshadow on because it's really making it pigmented. So I really didn't even need that much. And I'm gonna go in with this blendy brush and kind of just blend it out a little bit. Good. It's making it really easy to work with the eyeshadow. Now I'm gonna go in with some concealer. I'm gonna use a brighter concealer. So I'm gonna use the LA Pro Conceal. And I'm gonna do a cut crease. Cause this is about to get crazy. I ain't even done yet. This is about to get crazy. I'm not even. Hopefully, I have some damn concealer. I'm not even done yet. Okay, so I'm just taking this um, concealer and I'm going to create a cut crease. Okay, I kind of messed this up right here, but I'm gonna fix it. Now that I created my cut crease, I have this palette, She Glam from Sheen. It has these pretty beautiful colors, and I'm gonna take this light purple right here and add it in um, on the cut crease. Okay, so now I'm gonna go back in with this dark color and just kind of blend it. Take the blending brush and just blend everything. All 
right, so now that I have that done, I'm gonna take a little bit of white and I'm just gonna put it a little right here in the corner of my eye. All right, so I'm gonna go in with this NYX glitter glue and I'm just gonna take some and dab it on my eyelid. I don't wanna put too much glitter, just a little bit. And I got these little loose glitters from Amazon and I'm just gonna, it's kind of like a purple pink and I'm just gonna take it and dab it on top of my eye. Okay guys, so now that this part is done, um, I've put enough glitter on my eyes. Um, this is like the ending to the main effects part. I'm gonna go ahead and finish these two parts and put like my regular makeup on. And when I finish, I'm gonna come back and show you guys the finished product. Okay guys, look at this. This young looks so good. Oh, It was very tedious and very time consuming. But I love it. I'm too sexy for this chain, too sexy for your game, too sexy for this fame. Yeah, yeah. I love this look guys okay so thank you guys for watching let me know what y'all think about this I love it so it was very tedious but honestly it really didn't take me that long like uh, two hours hour, hour and a half two hours which is okay for me but I absolutely I had so much fun doing this so comment down below, let me know what you think. You liking it, you feeling it? Should I do more little crazy looks like this? <sighs> I'm just in love. I'm about to go take some pictures. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys on the next video. Peace.